Hi everyone, welcome to Naresh Technologies. This is Srinivas. In the last session, we discussed some of the patterns printing in a C language. So, now we will see some more discussions on how to print a patterns, different types of patterns. Okay. So, now, so today pattern is, so this is so 5 stars, so 4 stars, 3, 2, 1. This is a pattern we are going to print now. In how many ways we can print? Right, we use uh, some modify operators and two iterators we are using, nothing but two for loops we are using, right? And based on uh, increment operators and decrement operators, in different ways we can print this pattern. How just look at this, how many rows we have totally five rows? So, outer loop should repeat uh, five times less than or equals to five i plus plus because in a outer loop and in a inner loop, I am using modify operator that is a increment operator plus plus. And next in a for loop j value. So, what is that initialization? So, what is the condition? And next one incrementation is a plus plus only this is inside we are printing printf star skeleton already we know. And next one after printing one row we need to send the control to next line. So, new line character here we are giving right here it is. So, i value is a 1. So, j value I mean i is less than or equals to 5 condition true the control move inside with i value 1 and here it is how many stars it should print means 5 stars it should print 5 stars. So, what is the logic we need to write means here it is i value starts with j value starts with i j is less than or equals to 5 see look at this i value starts with 1. So, j value also starts with the i value. So, what is the i value here? 1. 1 is less than or equals to 5 condition true. The control move inside and it will print the star. First star it will print. Next j value will increase. So, j value become 2. j value become 2. 2 is less than or equals to 5 condition true. So, come inside it will print the second star. Next one j value 3, 4, 5. So, whenever j value becomes 6, so then inner for loop execution will be terminated and then the control come out of the for loop and it will print the slash n nothing but a new line character it will print. So, that it will send the control to next line. Whenever outer for loop execution completed once, one iteration completed, then it will go for second iteration. So, that is i value will increase by 1 i plus plus. Here it is i value become 2 i value become 2, the control come inside, see again j value restarts with the i. So, now what is that i value is a 2, here it is very clearly it is showing that i value is a 2. So, j value again restarts with a 2. So, first condition is a 2 is less than or equals to 5, yes condition true, so that it will print one star, it is a first star it will print, here it is the first star. And next the value become 3 and next value become 4 and the value become 5. Here it is a 4 iterations happening. For all 4 iterations, for every iteration 1 star it will print, so that 4 stars it will print in the second row. And next again inner for loop will be terminated and again new line character, so that outer loop executes i value become 3, i value become 3. So, again j value restarts with a 3, 3 with a 3 1 iteration next value become 4, 1 iteration, value become 5, 1 iteration. So, how many iterations here? 3 iterations totally. So, 3 starts it will print in the third row. So, like that it will go. Okay. So, it will print this pattern. So, using modify operator, increment operator in a outer for loop and increment operator in a inner for loop. Sir, here instead of printing star, suppose if I print i value if I print i value, so what is the pattern it will print? So, what will be the pattern here? Right. So, look at the pattern. Here it is, in the first case i value is a 1. So, 5 times it will print 1, 5 times. Here it is a 5 stars it will print. Na? In place of a star, it will print the ba background value of i. So, what is the background value of i? With 1 it is executing. So, 5 times 1, 4 times 2, 3 times 3, 2 times 4, and 1 time 5 it will print, this is a pattern it will print. 
instead of printing i value means instead of printing star suppose if you print i value it will print this pattern sir instead of i suppose i am printing j value then what will be the pattern what will be the pattern look at this whenever i value equals to 1 it starts with 1 so 1 2 5 so 5 times it will repeat 1 2 3 4 5 and second iteration i value is a 2 so j value is also starts with a 2 2 3 4 5 so total 4 iterations so here it is a 2 3 4 5 next one i value is a 3 so it starts with a 3 3 4 5 so 4 5 and 5 so this is a pattern okay so in the interviews so not only they will ask printing only stars in the process of printing any patterns right instead of printing stars they may ask the, to print some values like this such type of patterns also they will ask no need to worry about that if you are perfect in how to print the patterns using increment operators and decrement operators it is very easy to print such kind of patterns okay so now we'll see one more the same pattern we are printing but in a outer loop we are using i minus minus and inner loop also we are using j minus minus using decrement operators how to print the same pattern okay see see so how to print the same pattern so 5 3 4 2 1 these stars so this pattern how to print so using using modify operators so that is a decreasing right see for example so outer for loop outer for loop we are taking so i value so now in a decreasing order so i value we know so total 5 rows i equals to 5 i is greater than or equals to 1 i minus minus this is outer loop now just look at the inner for loop here it is a what is the initialization and what is the condition and what is the what is a modify operator only modify operator is confirmed at so that is j minus minus in a outer for loop i minus minus so what is the initialization and what is the condition c and remain in skeleton i am writing as usual printf so we are printing star in a inside for loop and once one row printing is over it will send the control to next line it will send the control to next line how to print now look at this five stars it has to print so first i value starts with a five so so j value j value totally five stars it should print five stars so j value starts with a i j is greater than or equals to one look at this so first i value starts with a 5 first i equals to 5 so i value starts with a 5 5 is greater than or equals to 1 yes condition true come inside it prints the first star first star next j value is decreasing so j value become 4 next value become 3 next value become 2 next value become 1 so total 5 times it is repeating so whenever it is a 0 then it will fail for 5 iterations, so 5 stars it will print in the first row. So, once first row printing is over, it will send the control to next line and outer for loop will execute. That is nothing but i value become 4. i value become 4. Again, so j value starts with a 4. Now, i value is a 4. So, j also starts with a 4. So, 4 is greater than or equals to 1. Condition true next j minus minus it will become 3 it will become 2 it will become 1 so for four iterations so it will print a four stars in the second row second row whenever it will become zero so then inner loop will be terminated again outer loop executes so i value become 3 so in a third row printing so again j value starts with a 3 next value become 2 next value become 1 so three iterations three stars it will print in the third row right so like that so to print this pattern suppose if you are using decrement operator in the outer loop and decrement operator in the inner loop so these are the initialization values and these are the conditions and same story suppose here instead of star sir suppose if i print i value so what will be the pattern it will print so very simple first i value is a 5 in the first iteration next to 4 next 3 next 2 next 1 so in the inner loop inner loop repeats five times right every time we are printing i value only so what is the i value first time five so five times it will print five 
next four times it will print four three times three two times two and only one time is a one it prints this pattern this pattern will print sir instead of i value suppose i am printing j value so then what will be the output so first time is a 5 it starts with a 5 so 5 4 3 2 1 it will print 5 4 3 2 1 next i value become 4 so it starts with a 4 4 3 2 1 next i value become 3 it starts with a 3 3 2 1 next to 2 1 and 1 this is the output okay so instead of printing stars Suppose if you print I value or if you print J value, so different patterns it will print. So these patterns also very very important in the interview point of view. Okay, so this is, sir. For example, if you use a increment operator in the outer loop and decrement operator in the inner loop, or a increment operator in the inner loop, decrement operator in the outer loop. The, what are the patterns and how to print the same pattern? Okay, and such type of patterns how can we print? Okay, so that we'll see in our next session. For more videos, please subscribe to Nareshati channel. Thank you.